Hi everybody! It's been a little while since I've been on. It's crazy busy time of year at work for me. So this is a little compilation um, video. A couple little online hauls and I got some surprise happy mail from Roseanne, Roxycar11. Hi sissy! Thank you! Have a Well I've broken the seal on the box but I haven't peeked in yet. I figured I'd um, go through the um, the little hauls first. Um, I shopped a little more with Tibbs, uh, Spellbound 987. Her uh, Etsy store is Sprinkles on My Cupcake. And I got some more of her awesome die cuts. Look how pretty that is. Gorgeous. And she has a limited supply of flowers in there also. And these are so pretty. White rosebuds. And these are fabric. And some beautiful light pink ones. And I can't remember what these are called. But I absolutely love them because they are so different. Aren't those gorgeous? And these are fabric also. Those are absolutely beautiful. I'm glad I got two. And some pretty little white ones. And the very, very super light lavender ones. And I'll hold them next to the white so that you can see the difference. Actually, that might be cream, and then this one is white. Absolutely gorgeous. Love those tabs. And she put a couple little, um, a little other goodies in the box for me. Um, this is one of her rubber stamp designs, and that is going to be so awesome for me with art journaling. And I haven't even had a chance to sit down and try her face painting um, booklet yet. And she also included this amazing, I wouldn't call it a placemat because I certainly wouldn't put any dishes or food on top of it. But this is just absolutely stunning. And whenever I get around to doing my lace and fabric book, this is definitely going to be the cover for it. It is so gorgeous. Thank you so much, Tibbs. You did not have to do that. And this oh, is just stunning. I absolutely love it. Gives me a little incentive to uh, get that lace book going. Someday. It's on the list. <laughs> and I also did a little shopping with um, Lily, who is Shabbylicious on Zibbit. And... Oops. Got some of these um, white curly sprays. Those are just fun. And I'm sure they'll take dyes if I want to change the color of them. And these are some um, pearlized little bead caps and these are gorgeous. They're nice and small, but the pearl on them is just absolutely beautiful. And it keeps flipping over in my hand. <laughs> the sprays that she has in her store. Again, I can't remember the name of it, but that's in cream and just gorgeous. And some of her awesome leaf dangle trim. 
I love this. There's just so much movement in it. I hope the lighting's okay. The sun keeps going in and out today. Got some yummy goodness there. Some of these gorgeous little pink flowers with the uh, with the rhinestone centers. I'm gonna have to go back and look to see what I ordered because I th I think she's tossed in a couple of extra things in here, and I actually re received both of these packages last week, and I just have not had time to do anything with them. Some of the gorgeous small heart appliques. Those are beautiful. Great size too. And these are what Lily calls the perfect cameo and I have to agree with her on that. They're a great size. It's an, um, like a tan color background and the white image. I mean, it's just so neutral. That's going to go with absolutely everything. It's gorgeous. And that comes in a package of five. Oh, and metal butterflies. It comes in three different colors. And there's two of each. Well, these are awesome. The pink, black, and white. Love those. And this is another style of heart applique or another design. It's a cream color with um, almost like a taupe color bow on the inside. Gorgeous, love them. This is one of her um, embroidered trims that is absolutely beautiful. Well, that, that, that's going to be gorgeous on projects. And this is a cotton embroider on just the palest, palest pink. And that's on the um, on the mesh, and you can put ribbon through that if you want to. But that oh my god, that pink is just gorgeous. So that's Yummies from Lily's store, Shabby Licious, and I will put links to um, her shop and um, Tibbs down below in the description. Definitely go um, take a look see. I mean. Tim's flowers, when they're gone, they're gone. So if you if you see them still on her site, then um, then grab them. I mean, they are just absolutely gorgeous. Love them. And now my surprise from Roseanne. What did you do, Roseanne? She's such a sweetheart. Oh my goodness. Oh. One of her awesome, awesome chunky tags. Actually, I just watched the video on this last night. <laughs> oh my gosh. And it's for me. Oh, thank you, sissy. This is beautiful. Oh my gosh, all the layers. Wow. She did a tutorial on how she makes her tags. Well, there's a note here. Aw, oh, thank you too, sissy. I love her stamp on the back. And she puts that on her uh, package labels too. That's so pretty. But this tag is amazing. The image looks like it was printed on silk. And there's just a, 
layers of lace and fabric. Wow. Lots of little bits in here. A double butterfly. Triple bow at the top. This is just gorgeous. I'll show you from the bottom up. All kinds of pretty little bits in there. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you, Sissy. I love it. I have a Roseanne Chunky tag. <laughs> oh, and all these fibers up the top. And then she actually attached another piece of paper on the, um, on the back of it to put the note on. That is gorgeous, Roseanne. Thank you so much. I could just get lost looking at all the little bits in that cluster. That's gorgeous. Buttons and bling and pearls. I just got a swirl in here. Paper flowers, rosette. Dictionary paper, it looks like. But it looks like if it was on her desk, it made it into the tag. And wow, I mean, what a gorgeous, gorgeous composition. Thank you. And a box of yummies. What have you done, Roseanne? I don't even know where to start. Look at that gorgeous flower dressing up the bag. Of course, you know I love these bags. Yeah. Don't want to tear anything. have a choice. A little bit of a tear there. Oh my gosh. Roseanne. Oh my gosh, look at this bridal trim. Oh, that is so gorgeous. You don't see it very often where in, in the um, tool part you actually have some design too. Oh, that is gorgeous. And the AB sequins. Beautiful. A piece of applique. Oh, that's pretty. This is so light. Gorgeous embroidery work on there. Another gorgeous appliques here. My gosh, Sissy, how did you part with all this? Oh wow, love that. I love the shape of it. Beautiful. Oh, gorgeous. These are just stunning. Oh my gosh, and this is what all oh, the pearls on it. Oh my goodness. How yummy is that? Oh, thank you, sissy. Oh. Another beautifully decorated bag. And this one is made out of book paper. First edition book paper. <laughs> what 
Oh my goodness, she's been <laughs> collecting butterflies. <laughs> oh wow, these are great. Oh my gosh, look at the variety. This is one of those times where I wish my hand was ten times bigger than it is. Oh, these are fun. And that was nice and sparkly. Oh, cool. I know she had to have made this one. And probably that one too. I'm sure she made all the paper ones. But these are fabric and feathers and look how fun those are. Those are awesome, sissy. Thank you. And some more nylon ones. Super cute. And then paper ones. And I, I know she had to have made these. Oh, that's cool. The top, this is a double layer one, and the top layer is actually transparency film or acetate. Super cool. Thank you, sissy. Love them. It's a box of bags. <laughs> This is gorgeous. Excuse me while I admire it for a minute. Look how pretty that is. I'm sure she made that rosette and that's with a pink lace. And it looks like um, an avocado dyed doily. Acrylic flower and pearls and bling and lace applique. This lace is gorgeous. A gold applique there and a little satin rose. I love the paper too. And what has she tucked inside? What a great idea. She rolled up paper to make the sides and the bottom to make this little pouch. That is so stinking clever. I want to have to scrap lift that idea. That's awesome. Aww. <laughs> little rubber stamp. That owl is adorable. Too cute. Love this one. Yes, um, now that I'm trying to do the art journal and um, started playing with um, jelly plate, then I'm looking at my stamps and stuff in a whole new way, bringing out things that I haven't used in forever. I don't know if this is glued on. Now let's see. Napkins! Woohoo! Oh, this is gorgeous. I don't think I've seen that one. That is absolutely beautiful. Love it. Oh, and I'll always know this one's from her because that is totally her colors. Beautiful. Another gorgeous Eiffel Tower one. Beautiful flowers. Love the peacock.
colors on that are gorgeous. Oh, this bird is beautiful. I hope these are showing up okay. Butterflies and flowers. And some more butterflies and flowers. Another Eiffel Tower. Love the flowers on that. That's gorgeous. And this is just adorable fun. Thank you, Sissy. We can never have too many napkins, right? <laughs> Holy McRoly girl. Beautiful. Another altered bag. Gorgeous. And the rolled paper and a paper um, doily die cut tucked in there. The burlap. Love that color blue. Beautiful flower, too. I'm going to have to go back and see if we have a tutorial on that one. That's really cool. I love the color on these. It's earrings. And a necklace. I can't tell if my camera is focusing or not because it's totally time for new glasses. <clears throat> and awesome crowns. Fun, yummy goodness. Well, that lace is pretty. Oh, this is gorgeous. She did a paper bow using the like the ribbon fishtail cut. That's really cute. Beautiful eyelet. More burlap, gorgeous butterfly, the bird, the roses, a bow made out of the strings from the burlap, sheet music that she's um, run over with blue and gold paints. Beautiful. And this is book paper again. I didn't know, he said. As soon as I did, I told you. Yeah, I nodded. I know. <laughs> James Patterson book. <laughs> see, see, what have you done? Aww. Some of her awesome crochet flowers and bows and hearts. I love these flowers. I hope you can remember how you did them. Because I, I want to learn. Look at those flowers. So stinking cute. And the bows. And the hearts. I love them. I can't remember if you actually crocheted the flowers or if it was a trim that you used to make them, but they are awesome. Those are so cute. And doilies! Oh, these are really pretty. Hope you can see that okay. The 
These are awesome, sissy. Thank you. Oh, that's really cool. That's an unusual design. I haven't seen that one. Yummy, thank you. Oh, how cute is this? She's altered a little linen bag or cotton bag. Is it, if that's a stamp on top of that paper, that is so cool. I love that. Some eyelet trim and the rose and the seam binding, buttons, applique, book paper, and that image on there is just awesome. Ooh. If that's a stamp, I have never seen any stamps like that. Love it. Goodness, we've got a lot in here. Oh wow. Little clock piece and a little crown. Bling crown. I love these little clocks, they're so cute. And with a little pearl bow. Trying to angle them so that there's not so much glare. I hope it's working because I'm having a hard time seeing it. And another clock and a little uh, bling, perfect flower center. What a great idea to put them in with these little clocks. I mean, that's, I love, love, love clocks. And these are awesome. Another gorgeous embellishment. Beautiful brooch. Love that little clock. And that's two-sided. It's the same on both sides, but very cool. Bottle cap charm. Super cute. And another clock. A gorgeous embellishment. And laces with stick pins. Oh, let me show you this one first. Awesome. And these uh, mason jar tags that she put them on, so cute. Well, that's a nice long stick pen. Gorgeous. And a pretty little white lace. And look at that tag. Oh, show you the front of it. That is so cute. That's like some um, vintage, um, not hem tape, but um, hem lace. Gorgeous, um, rosy red. Beautiful stick pen with a little charm dangling on it. 
cute little bow. Oh, this is so soft. That's a really pretty red. I hope it's showing through on my uh, camera screen. It looks really, really red, but it's almost like a light burgundy. Gorgeous. <coughs> and some vintage buttons. And she actually sewed them onto the card. Awesome, Roseanne, thank you. And then there's one more. My gosh, you got a lot in that box. It's a glassine bag. It says Vintage Yummies. And I gotta take in all the decoration on it. Oh, this is so much fun. I'm not even gonna try to explain it. <laughs> Because <laughs> there's a lot going on there, and it is just fun to look at. I like the brown, the uh, brown glassine. I haven't uh, come across that myself. Holy macaroni, sissy! Oh my goodness! Oh, that's so pretty. This one's gathered and I love the cream color of it. A pretty black one. And I'm sorry I was unprepared with, you know, not having Hard stock to show these properly. And look how pretty that little bundle is. Just tied it with a piece of lace. Super tiny lace that is just adorable. Oh my gosh. Wow, this is amazing. It's actually scalloped. That is so small and so detailed. I love that. Love this color. Oh, that's pretty. It's a printed fabric with the embroidered eyelet. That'll make gorgeous flowers. Oh, and how cute is that? Cotton down the center, button pattern with the um, gathered and scalloped lace on either side. Super cute. Gorgeous light pink. Oh, this is so soft. Gorgeous. Roseanne, you have totally spoiled me. You did not have to do this. And this one is wicked soft too. And wow, look at the pattern on that. That's really unusual. I gotta find something that you might can see it on. Hmm. No, that's not gonna work.
that's not a pattern I've seen before. That is just gorgeous. <coughs> oh, how pretty. Some gorgeous flowers to cut out there if I'm so inclined to use this one that way. Beautiful. Oh, this is a stretchy one and also beautiful and wide. Goodness gracious. Oh, this is pretty. Look at that design. I hope you can see it okay. It's super pretty. That's like a dark, dusty rose. Oh, and this one's gorgeous too. Wow. Well, sissy, you spoiled me rotten, <laughs> and you surprised me. Thank you so much. It's all so wonderful. But more wonderful is, is your friendship. I, I wish we were able to talk on Skype a little bit more often, but um, your time zone and my time zone, since, since your time is behind mine, I'm usually in bed by the time you're uh, able to get on. So, <laughs> But I do love when we are able to chat together. Thank you so much for everything. You really did not have to do this. Love it. Love you. Thanks for your friendship and for being my sissy. Mwah! And I will put the link to um, Roseanne's um, channel down below, although you probably all know her already, uh, Roxy Car 11 and um, links to the to Tibbs and Lily's shops down below also. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to come back before too long. I've been playing with my jelly plate. I've been, um, I followed Scrappy Jack's um, tutorial on making your own, your own mold putty with a silicone. Um, so I've been playing with that and making some molds. It's been a lot of fun, a huge mess, but it's been a lot of fun. <laughs> So hopefully soon I'll be able to come back and um, show you what I've been up to. And um, thank you all so much for watching and hope to see you soon. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.